Okay guys, I'm doing my first ever haul and it's a baby haul. Not a baby, I don't, I'm not hauling babies. But, so I went into Walmart. I found these, can you see that? Girl Legos and they're five bucks and it has 228 pieces. Isn't that awesome? So that. And you know, Christmas is coming right around the corner. And this is like nothing special, but I, I do like these. 40 cents for each um, composition notebook. And I got um, one teal, one blue, one black. 40 cents each. And then, these are cute. They had a whole bunch of different ones. But for $2, I got... Um, puzzle pieces and there's 500 of them and this has the best of Northern California 500 pieces for two dollars really nicely made on the outside so I can just imagine like what it looks like inside painting the town see the best of season one painting the town with Eric Dow um, so that's really super cool Let me turn off. and then um Oh, I'm getting hot. Okay, and then this was, it's a braided lightning USB cable. Can you see it? Um, for the iPhone. I think he said $5 for this, which, you know, I mean, it's not like an Apple one or nothing. And then I got, hopefully this will work. It is a phone mount. Um, four-in-one mounting kit for either the window, the dash, the vent, or the console. So, this is what I actually came in for, or went in for. So, I'm going to open it up, put everything else back in. Because right now I'm going to go to the kids' house. There we go. It's working now. Okay. Um, let's see. I'm gonna put you guys down for a minute. Ooh, it is like really hot right now. Which that's a good thing because usually Halloween it's kind of rainy. So it's good that it's not rainy right now. Um Everything's in the bottom of the purse. So I wonder, at this exact moment, I wonder what Sarcastic Potato is doing. I'm so a stalker. The last video I watched of her is when she was watch, walking her dog and her dog's best friends. Ew. I don't know what the heck happened to that. Let's see. Okay. So. Yeah, I feel so much better talking in the car. Oh gosh, is there an Oh, you know what, and darn it, I really didn't want, oh, this is if I want to mount it right, oh, it's got a suction though, alright, because I don't like, I don't want it to be taped.
cleaning wipes. And this has a lot of pieces because there's three different ways you can do it. I wonder if... Which way should I do it? I hate putting stuff together. Where does this go? What does this thing do? Oh, this goes a different way. This goes back, I think. I'm like so retarded. I don't even know if I like this yet. We'll see. Okay. Now what? This is for... No. What does this do?
supposed to be? What is this? experiment with this because you guys need to oh there's something right there too hmm. yeah i'll have to see what it's all about anyways so i'm um, gonna go to my son's house see if that works and I'm gonna get back on the freeway and go to my son's house I don't even know if I'm connected to you now I have no idea okay so that was pretty cool obviously I got something it should be like See, I get like really like psyched if, um, like psyched out. I should have that pizza for the kids from Costco. Kids are so excited right now. taping it. Dang, this looks really bad because that's a look down look. It does have, maybe I can do that because it has that thing that can be mounted to the, the windshield. It's five o'clock. Well, yeah, but usually going north is not packed. Going south is packed at five. Oh my gosh! When I'm looking down, it is like super, super fat. I can't wait to see what my grandson is in. I'm not going to go on the freeway, but I usually 
usually get off right here anyways, so it doesn't really matter. Another reason why I really, because I do suffer from night blindness. Um, I have nearsighted vision, which that's getting bad now too. I have to have computer glasses on. Um, but, uh, oh, I shouldn't have worn this. Now I'm going to be hot. But it's starting to cool down. It's nighttime almost. But, um, what was I going to say? Um, and so, because I have night blindness, I'm starting to get dark. And kids run back and forth in the street if their parents don't teach them right. Um, I was reading his sign. Um, so yeah, it, it kind of can get overwhelming with the kids and stuff. And you know, they're just having fun. They want to get to the next house, you know, before that house runs out. Trick or treats, and um, you know. So what we normally do is we won't go in residential. We won't drive in residential. First, we'll go to the the church here in town. Well, there's a lot of them, but we know which ones to go to. And then we'll park, and we'll you know go down residential busy houses, and you know take the kids so they can trick or treat there. So it was just normal for me to have my kids do pillowcases. Um, there's one, see that's one thing when you when you grow up with hokey parents, you do things that is normal to you, but when you start to grow up, you realize that dang, you know, they don't do it the way we used to do it. So when you told your friends, nah, man, we did this, and we did pillowcases, and, you know, we jumped on water beds in our backyard, you know, um, we, we would take our water bed mattresses, and we'd be out with our water beds, and we would put soap on a full water bed, it had as much water as we could put in it, we'd put soap on it, we'd run from, you know, like 20 miles, or 20 miles, 20 feet away, 50 feet away, and we would skid on it, just like a um, uh, slip and slide. We didn't have money for slip and slides, but I'll, I'll bet you a dollar everybody wanted to slip and slide on our waterbed mattress. Oh man, we uh, would slip on it in the, in the daytime, and then come, come time to go to sleep, and you know, we'd clean it all off, and I'd take my sheet out there, and. I would sleep in the backyard on that waterbed mattress and it was the funnest thing I'd ever do. You know, looking up at the stars. That was basically my home away from home was my backyard. Um, you know, when you're in that 
take that time. You know, you think your life is bad. You know, you wish you can't, you know, you wish you could grow up fast and buy you whatever you want. You know, you want to go to the store and buy a piece of cake or a whole cake. You're gonna do it, and that's what you wanted to grow up for. So you can buy your own stuff, stuff, your own self stuff, you know? Um, I couldn't remember the first time I left home and I stayed, I lived with a bunch of us girls. I was 17 and I had just graduated from high school. And first thing I did when I, I had a part-time job at the good part-time job at the Goodwill got my first little check you know back then it was like I don't know six hundred dollars a week and the first job I got was at this this little mom-and-pop restaurant and I got three I think it was like three twenty five an hour three dollars and twenty five cents an hour and um, you know well maybe not six hundred dollars maybe it was every two weeks it probably was and boy I'll tell you I've never had you know five hundred bucks all on my own and um, boy I honestly thought this late this girl was bawling not like bawling like crying just like bawling how the young people say bawling you know we were bawling or is it bowling bowling maybe it's bowling we were bowling yeah because you could be happy in your bowling and you get almost getting that strike but anyways it's already going to be 21 minutes or it's already going to be 22 minutes oh it's 22 minutes so um i really haven't done much but it's my first vlog i think no i had vlogs before when i was driving to work um, i could do an outro with the phone turned around and we could drive in my car and listen to music but no that's already been taken I don't know what an outro is, but I'm going in my son's house. I am here. And, um, oh, somebody's not there, though. Darn it. I don't know. Okay, guys. Peace. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.